I think honestly, uh, part part of it is uh, matchup and experience. Yeah. I, I think she's yeah she has the tools, but you need to be really good. Kind of maybe kind of like the Mies. Like not many people play them, so they look really good. And they have tools, but yeah. No. But once you know the tools, I mean, I, I've got a good experience against Palutena's and wow. Well, oh. All right, so All right. the game's starting, and Ghoul's gonna stick with Corrin, actually. Oh. I guess he decided that Mega Man was probably a bad idea. But I guess that that's really smart of him, because, well, Wario can actually eat most of uh, Mega Man's projectiles. Good admit. For those that didn't know, he can eat the bomb, he can eat, uh, I think, probably the Metal Blade. Uh, well, that's a projectile and an item. I yeah. don't see why you couldn't. So that's not really a good matchup for Magma. Man. Yeah, on the guess. other hand, has good spacing tools. Ba ba so. ba well, basically, uh, Mega Man would have his uh, his lemons, but all of his good project house would just be eaten. Oh, he can hit tornadoes as well. Nice. Did, did he just <laughs> use this waff? I uh, didn't see. Actually, well. wasn't looking. I was looking at the chat because someone mentioned Wario yeah. can actually eat tornadoes. Well, that's a project done. That's something I didn't know actually. They can be reflected too. Yeah, which that, is that's pretty nice. I've seen. It's really hilarious. <laughs> if you thought getting blown up the stage with a tornado was bad, try yeah. getting it like spiked by a tornado that was reflected. Spiked by a tornado. It's a horrible. That it's a horrible feeling. Yeah. And right now we have both players in kill percent. Uh, Corin, except from a smash, is still safe. I mean, he's not a, at a comfortable yeah. percentage, but Corin's kind of heavy. She's so not well. heavy, but she's far from light. Yeah. yeah. But of course, Warrior still has his Wa. But if you said he already used it, well. Yeah, I forgot to notice the time when he used it, though. Well, it's one. It's uh, it's uh, 100 seconds. So 1 minute 40 for the full WAF. 50 seconds for the half WAF. And well, half WAF's pretty good as well. And, Car and Carmen's laying the person right, right now. Yeah. Well, Standing his lead. Corrin's definitely a hard matchup for Warrior because there's not much work can actually do to get in. Yeah. Corrin's really good at spacing out. And Warrior, I mean, he's got to get close. Yeah. And. And Ghoul's usually a pretty defen pretty defen defensive, pretty Yeah, Ghoul's got a new, big uh, defense. Fundamental based player. And right now. You don't see Ghoul really attacking a lot. He just punishes and prevents someone from getting close. And Karin, uh Karin Media Man, perfect for him. Well, these two characters do have the tools for it, so. Yep. And right now he's showing it. 15% oh. and Wario's definitely well, near Wario's kill. Wario's got his WAF. There's a WAF, but, but right the now WAF it isn't kill. going to kill no. before... I saw him kill at 80 early, earlier. Oh, 80, he can 80. kill at 40 on the side. If, if, he's on, if they're on the side of the ledge at 40, he's going to kill. Mm. He just Especially with that rage. Yeah. But and he's, 40 he's coming up. <laughs> yeah. The roll. And like we saw, I mean... I would, I, it wouldn't have killed from where Ghoul was, but it was still a good try at that point. Game one to, going to Ghoul. So it's winner semis, is that Mesa 5? Uh, yep. Oh. Uh, that's what uh, Bird just said. Oh, so it's Mesa 5. So Gulsa has two games to win, these are three of them, so anything can happen. Uh, Town and City is the next one. Hmm, I'm kind of surprised. I wouldn't think um, well, it's White would like a stage with that kind of ceiling. Well, the ceiling's not that bad, but the platforms allow him to uh, hmm. camp out oh, a bit, Corin, so... He's, he's probably going for a longer game. See, yeah. he's keeping his distances and just probably Makes stacking sense. his WAF. Maybe he's gonna go for a double WAF kill. Makes sense. And and Corin, no, Corin will do the platforms too. I mean, 
Like but we said, Ghoul's a defensive player, so camping him out shouldn't be too hard. Yeah. Of course, I Unless guess Town Scene is not actually the best stage for it. But it's a good stage for camping. Yeah. There's Sonic's probably a bit of it. player familiarity in that. Mm. And stuck one going after only 33%. Yeah, it doesn't Goal seem to be going like Goal with a sizable like lead right now. Huh? After that, it's correct. So yeah, so right now Goose has, has a pretty comfortable lead. My leader is doing a bit better now that he's stopped camping because he cannot afford to camp anymore. Nope. Last stock. He and needs to play safe, but can't just like stay away. And he's actually taking making it back. Kind of. Well he lost his first stock really early, so. But at the same time Coring does a lot of damage. And see? Ghoul apparently has it has adapted. See here he, he uh, they they basically back, just back. seventy percent combo each other and Waft is online. Yeah, but Ghoul still has two stocks. Oh. At at that point oh. he'll probably try to clear that start le legit. Yeah, he, he needs to keep his Waft. The only way he, he can win right now on this is he plays really, really well. Is keeping that WAF. He, yep. he needs to somehow take that stock without the use of his WAF. And uh, he definitely can. Start. Oh, oh yay. That's taste spike. We usually take those. <laughs> <laughs> Guess not. Uh, well, one person defini definitely tagged it and the other did. didn't. Now, can Dieter keep the momentum, rack up the damage enough for a kill? Well, That's a question. Well, he almost has that sweep percent. Well, with a good, good setup, he can kill. See? Ooh. There we go. Like I said, 40%. It kills up the side. Well, that... Well, I guess people are going for me. <laughs> mm -hmm. People are calling for Ginger. Pokemon time. Oh. So, well, uh, Ginger out and, well, uh, 2-0. All right, I'm back alone. Sorry. All there in front of many people. Um, what do we have? We have one one. God. Yep. Uh, no, I think no, I think he was uh, Max's lift to go. I think that's what I understood. Game three coming coming up. Battlefield. Girl open. Girl open opening up the match, writing writing up some pretty sweet percent. And that's Trumbert coming taking up the set and mic. Hello. I'll be joining you for a commentary for uh, this match in Winner's Semi, so best of five. Uh, I see it's 1-1. One, one. So Dieter with a slight disadvantage at the moment, but uh, you know, the thing is with Wario, if you can keep your fart, and it, it doesn't matter if you're behind, if you can have the fart and then take the first stock. If, once you take the first stock of the uh, of the opponent and you have your fart, uh, I wouldn't say okay. you've won the match, but you know, you've got a good chance. So. It's not yeah. the end of the world here that he's a little bit behind. Yeah, we, we saw it perfectly with, la with last game where Wario took a kill at like 30%. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 30-40% is pretty much a sweet spot range where uh, combos are going to connect easily to fart like a Nair up here. And, war and Wario cut up pretty nicely. Green bad the person. Pretty close. So uh, for those who don't know, uh, today we've, we got quite a few upsets. Uh, first of all, Fairlines lost to Joe, then uh, Cal lost to Evie. Oh, that, that was a wow! Well, that was a horrible recovery, but makes it back even though it got hit by a forward smash with 70, uh, 97 percent rage. 
Ooh, and he wastes the wah. The farts, the, the, the farts, yeah, he had multiple farts. Oh yeah, he wastes uh, the fart here and that's it's really too bad. Because that's uh, really Wario's trump card. I'm not, not sure why he used it at such a low percentage. It seems like a big gamble. Uh, low, uh, low, per, low percent? Weren't they like both at 100? Uh, sorry, uh, such a high percent. I said low percent. I meant uh, high percent. Keeping him out right now. Yeah, so good, good DI by Dieter surviving until 171%. So he might actually get the second fart, but now he gets his stock. The bite. Yeah, now he's doing the smart thing, which is waiting on the platform up there, uh, trying to get the fart as soon as he can. A very unsafe town near there. I'm not sure what that was. <laughs> so now, uh, what Dieter has to do is kind of stall a little bit, try to get his fart back. Because. Winning one on one versus uh, versus Corrin is going to be difficult since uh, Corrin just outranges Wario pretty bad. Pretty much everything he can do. Ooh, good follow up nice. here on the spear using uh, an up smash. I don't think it was a true combo, but uh, still caught him. It worked. So now Cool has amazing stage control. You see that he's just he's in the middle there, not going away. Now that I say that, he gets kicked out. But uh, he kept the stage control at the center of the stage for about maybe one minute. That was amazing. Yep. So once again, goal in the back in the middle of the stage. Uh, Dieter. Oh, what's Dieter doing? Whoa, dangerous here. Not falling for that. Okay, we might see some bike jank. Watch out. Wow, he got him with the ha with a half waft and it killed him. So From great. the other side of the stage. Yeah, that was, that was a great setup by Dieter. I'm very impressed by yep. that. I'm, I'm surprised it killed pretty early yeah, from, it, well, to kill from the other side yeah, of the stage. It, 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 I feel like it killed him pretty early. He was at, what, 90% maybe? Yeah, it killed him from the other side of the stage with a half waft. I, I don't know, maybe he died the wrong way though, because um, I was expecting him him to go the other way, because of the that way that it was set up. But, uh, yeah, so maybe he killed himself with his DI, sadly. That would make a lot of sense. Right, so they're both thinking what to do here. Uh, Goldmania is trying to figure out which counter pick would be best. He can't go back on... Uh, where do you win? Uh, uh, I think both games were on... Uh, no, one game was on uh, the two smashes. Ghoul won on Smash game Ville. one on Smashville. All right. Then second one was uh, Town and City. Okay. All right. Okay, so uh, goal opting to go to uh, Final Destination, which is a decent choice because Wario is still going to have trouble approaching. Yep. And uh, and goal has the spam game with the, the Dragon Fang. I'm, I don't think can Wario eat the Dragon Fang. I'm not sure. Uh, I don't think so. The Dragon. F uh, the, the, yeah, the, the, the Dragon the Fang shot. Uh, yeah. The uh, ball. Probably it's a projectile. I think Wario can eat pretty much every project as safe, maybe an explosion. Well, uh, something that explodes. Yeah, well, he can eat it, but then he takes damage. So. Yep. Although, that explosion becomes a kill move, that's kind of weird. Like, if, if you eat one of Link's bombs, you can kill him with the, the, the like, explosion yeah. inside Wario. Yeah, I saw a few kill that way. So, once again, Go uh, doing a good job of keeping center stage. Not allowing Dieter to approach him and just uh, spacing him out. Yep. The, an unsafe spear is gonna get him grabbed and Throwing almost got jinxed. Out. Almost got jinxed by the uh, the down air, which can kill you if it trades with your up B. But I don't think it can trade with Corrin's up B's, considering uh, it I, I believe it has uh, armor on top of him, so or just a, a disjoint. Yeah. He probably needs a perfect angle and perfect timing to. Yeah, I'm, with it. I'm not even sure. I think even with the perfect timing, because of the way the uh, the, the hitbox is above Corrin, I don't think you can make it through. Yeah, uh, I'm not sure. I might sure. be wrong. Not sure either. But anyway, so we got stuck one ta taken by by a f by an F yeah by a F smash. And oh, this could be it. Wow, nope. the danger here. Uh, Gold here had pretty much no choice but to jump and uh, not jump, but to uh, roll and get grabbed. Oh, but runs into the Dragon Fang. Good pressure by Goldmania. 
Uh, yep. Dieter probably didn't want to get shield broken here or shield poked, so he tried to challenge it and then uh, just got hit by it instead. But he 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 was pretty far. Could have been on the edge of the bite. Yeah. And we have a waft online at that point. Good good double power shield by Dieter. Oh, unsafe forward smash is gonna get him speared. So now now comes very difficult time for Dieter. He has to get that kill and. Uh, Without using his waft, so this way that might be it. No, he okay. goes for the down throw, which is not going to kill. Yeah, uh, I'm surprised. I saw him. Um... Oh, that, that's oh, it. that's it. So it's going to be two yeah. two. Uh, yeah, uh, I saw I saw Dorme Romania do down throw at hundred more more, at hundred plus plus person. Yeah. Rome. Okay, bro, that's still 2-2. Two, two. Come on. But, uh, yeah. Um, I saw I saw Grohl do up throw, even high person. I would think that up throw would kill earlier. Uh, I'm not sure, honestly. I, I think it varies. I think... Down throw can kill earlier if they don't DI it properly, but up throw is going to be more reliable because you can't DI it as much. Uh, I think that's the difference, so that might be why he knew up throw wouldn't kill, so he went for down throw hoping for a bad DI. And at the same time, the advantage of using down throw is you're not going to stale the up throw if the up throw for is not later kill. on. Yeah. Yeah, this is best of five. It's a winner semi. So. Yep. And we have a pretty even game five so far. Both, pl both players tra trading stage control. Oh my goodness! <laughs> he, ch challenge, he challenged the, the, the launch with a forward tilt and beat it because yep. of Mario's huge fist, which is uh, has a disjoint on it. So. Wow, great pressure by Dieter. Read the roll after the down tilt. Uh, probably knew. Wow, he gold main is getting his rolls read all over the place. Now it's probably going to go for uh, motorcycle setup. I believe he could take that, but he's going to get uh, Tipper back here, which is going to kill him. So Dieter now is slightly behind, but like we said earlier, uh, Fart is going to be online soon. So anything going to happen? Yeah, it's not going to be much of an issue to be behind as long as he can stay. <laughs> as uh, he can take that stock. So Deidre has been working, uh, you know, he's been working on being a lot more patient. I think we're seeing that here. He, he, know, he knows what his game plan is and uh, he's trying to stick to it. And now, he approach. seems to have definitely ad adapted from, uh, from the early well, game, that could earlier be a game. Is that it? Yep. I don't think that was good DI by Gold, but might be wrong. Uh, it feels like it was a bit early for him to die there. Wario had no rage, and uh, it was only at 140, so... Yeah, the, the angel looked weird to me, too. But current current lane up a bit more per person on that side in stock. Alright, so good pressure again by Gold. Not that in land. But goal has to be careful because one mistake, one mistake means his death. Wario needs one there. Or and just a roll again gets his roll from red. the other side. Yeah, but the, he goal has to be careful. He was rolling all over the place. Yep. The, neither recognized it. Popped off. 